Why does Dave Ramsey say all debt is dumb? Well, because Dave Ramsey is a beautiful <laughs> 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 shit, me. No, I mean, <laughs> pardon my French. Who's your demographics, mm. right? You guys are real estate guys. Dave Ramsey is not your teacher. You're their teacher. Yeah, he's not wrong. Yeah. Yeah, I can't stand Dave Ramsey either. <laughs> but I mean, ultimately, he's right. Not all debt is dumb. You no. definitely, I mean, the richest person in the world, like we we're talking about, Elon Musk bought his company with $18 billion in debt. And he's the richest person in the world. I mean, the, the idea that debt is dumb is short-sighted for sure. You know, that's how people accumulate wealth. That's how they leverage it without having personal exposure. Like there's so much that you can utilize debt for as a tool versus looking at it as this negative thing, but it had to be strategic, right? Obviously $50,000 on a 28% credit card is not a good debt pull. But to your point, if you're using debt to acquire a business or to create wealth, it's a different animal. So, you know, a blanket statement like that is certainly less than uh, accurate overall. I mean, there's, I think, and at least in my opinion, there's a small percentage of the world that it does apply to, and they probably shouldn't take debt because they just can't manage it. That segment Box. of human population that has to spend every dollar that they have and, and is not very good at saving it, they should 100% listen to Dave Ramsey. Everybody else probably should. There you go. <laughs>